Hello everyone, how are you? I'm Fiore and today we are going to start with a book, okay? We are going to start with the Discovered English 1 book, page 63, okay? So this is the new book, Discovered English 1. No el que usaron eh, el año pasado, sino el libro nuevo, okay? Discovered English one page sixty three discovered English one page sixty three okay are you there excellent okay so we're going to do exercise four we have to label these clothes okay so, we have to look at the pictures and here, in the word bank, we have some words, okay? We have trousers, which is number two. We have a jumper, a dress, a skirt, a coat, a hat, a shorts, socks, shoes, jeans, a t-shirt and boots, okay? So, which one is a jumper? Which one is a jumper? What number is a jumper? Is it number seven or is it number three? A jumper. Very good. It's number three. A jumper is like a sweater, okay? Very good. A dress. This one is easy. A dress. Yes, very good. It's number six here. It's blue and it has yellow flowers. Number six. A skirt. A skirt. Which one is a skirt? Good. Picture number four. A skirt. A coat, a coat. Good, this one, number seven. Excellent. A hat, a hat. Which one is a hat? Write on the chat. Yes, very good. It's picture number 11. Excellent. Picture number 11. Shorts. Which ones are shorts? Yes, very good. They are number 10. Number 10 are shorts. Shoes. Shoes. Very good. Yes. Number eight. Uy, me salté socks. Which one is? Socks. Which number is socks? Yes. Very good. Number five. Excellent. And jeans. Which number are the jeans? jeans. Yes, very good. They are number nine. Excellent. And a t-shirt. Which one is a t-shirt? Yes, very good. Number one. And it has like a like a pig, right? A pink pig. And the t-shirt is green. And the last one, boots. Boots. Very good. Yes, they are number 12. They are red and they have white spots. Excellent. Okay, now we are going to listen, check and repeat. Okay. 6B. Exercise 4. Discover words. Label the clothes. Listen, check and repeat. 
One. A T-shirt. A T-shirt. Two. Trousers. Trousers. Three. A jumper. A jumper. Four. A skirt. A skirt. Five. Socks. Socks. Six. A dress. A dress. Seven. A coat. A coat. Eight. Shoes. Shoes. Nine. Jeans. Jeans. Ten. Shorts. Shorts. Eleven. A hat. A hat. Twelve. Boots. Boots. Excellent. Very good, guys. Okay. Now we are going to do a handout. Okay. So if you go to the virtual classroom, you will see that we have a handout called Reading Comprehension. Reading Comprehension. So let's grab that handout. Okay. It says seasons, weather, and clothes. And we have three pictures. Do you have this handout? Excellent. Very good. Okay, so we have to look at the pictures and read the text. In the pictures we have Jimmy and Karen, Emma and Mike, and Susan and Andy. Okay, so we're going to read the text about these friends, okay? And then we are going to answer these questions, okay? With complete answers. So, let's read. Jimmy and Karen are friends. They live in the USA. It's summer there at the moment. And the children want to go to the beach because they are really hot and they can swim in the sea. The children are wearing t-shirts, Jimmy is wearing a pair of shorts and his friend Karen is wearing a skirt. Okay, so this is Jimmy and this is Karen. They live in the USA and right now is summer. Okay, so in summer it's really hot. So they want to go to the beach to swim in the sea. Okay, good. Now, Emma and Mike. Emma and Mike are cousins. They live in Australia. The weather isn't sunny today. They are carrying their umbrellas. They are really big. The cousins like playing in the rain. They are both wearing t-shirts, but Emma is wearing trousers and her cousin is wearing shorts. So here we have Emma and Mike. We can see that it's raining, but they like the rain. Okay. Emma has her umbrella in her hand, but Mike has his umbrella open. Okay. Mike is wearing shorts, but Emma is wearing trousers. Let's read about Susan and Andy. Andy and Susan are brother and sister. They are in Bariloche at the moment. They love Bariloche in winter. Today, it's very, very cold there. Andy can ski, but Susan can't. She's wearing a nice woolly hat. Where are their jackets? Ooh, in the hotel. Okay, so it's very, very cold, but they are not wearing jackets. They left them at the hotel, okay? So, Let's take a look at the questions. Read the questions, write complete answers 
Use the information in the text and the pictures to help you. So, where do Jimmy and Karen live? Where do Jimmy and Karen live? Yes, very good. It's here. They live in the USA. Excellent. So, we need to write a complete answer. The complete answer would be they live in the USA. Excellent. Why is it hot there? Why is it hot there? Why is it hot in the USA at the moment? Write on the chat. Good. Yes, because it's summer. It's summer there at the moment. So they are really, really hot. Okay. Because... It's summer there Okay, good What is Karen wearing? What is Karen wearing? The children are wearing t-shirts Okay, so we know that Karen is wearing a t-shirt and Jimmy is wearing shorts, but his friend, Karen, is wearing a skirt. So, what is Karen wearing? Good. She is wearing a t-shirt and she is wearing a skirt. Okay. Good. So, she is wearing a t-shirt and a skirt. Very good. Okay, and now we have questions about Emma and Mike. Are Emma and Mike friends? Look, are Emma and Mike friends? What do you think? What does the text say? Are they friends? Mm -mm. No, they aren't. They are family. They are cousins. Son primos, no son amigos. They aren't cas they aren't friends. They are cousins. Good. Where do the friends want to go? Where do the friends want to go? So here we are being asked about Jimmy and Karen again. ¿A dónde quieren ir? Jimmy and Karen. Where do they want to go? Yes, they want to go to the beach. The children want to go to the beach because they are really hot. So, where do the friends want to go? They want to go to the beach. Excellent. Okay. Is Emma's umbrella big? Is Emma's umbrella big?
Read the text. Is Emma's umbrella big? Yes, very good. Their umbrellas are really big. Okay, are really big. So, yes. It is. Why are the cousins carrying umbrellas? Why are the cousins carrying umbrellas? Acuérdense que carrying era llevar. Why are the cousins carrying umbrellas? Good. Take a look at the picture. Why are they carrying umbrellas? What's the weather like? Yes, very good. It's raining. So that's why they are carrying umbrellas. Because it's raining. You can say because it's raining or you can say because it's raining. Both options are correct. Pueden decirlo de las dos formas. Because it's raining or because it's rainy. Ok. Ambas opciones son correctas. Now. What season is in Bariloche now? What season is in Bariloche now? So, now we have to read the text about Andy and Susan. They are in Bariloche. And what's the season now in Bariloche? Yes, look. It's winter. Okay, it's winter. So, what's the season now in Bariloche? It's winter. Okay, good. Very good. Who is wearing a woolly hat? Who is wearing a woolly hat? Is it Andy or Susan? Who is wearing a woolly hat? Look in the picture. ¿Quién tiene un gorro? Susan o Andy? Who is wearing a woolly hat? Woolly significa que es de lana. Un gorro de lana. Yes, very good. Susan, look. Very good. Susan is wearing a woolly hat. Excellent. Very good. And the last question. Can Susan ski? Can Susan ski? Can Susan ski? Look here. Andy can ski, but Susan can't. Susan can't. So, no. 
No, she can't. Very good. No, she can't. Because if we look in the picture, she is hurt. Está lastimada como mi hermana. Se lastimó el pie. She is hurt. She can't ski. No puede esquiar. Si se lastimó el pie. She can't ski. Okay. Good. Very good. I'm going to give you some minutes for you to copy everything. Okay. Let me know when you finish. Okay, excellent. So, that is going to be all for today's class. Have fun in Zoom and I will see you next class. Goodbye!